Yes. It's time for the kids to line up at the door. I put her up to that. Don't don't do anything to her. Okay. Uh, it's great having grandkids. I can tell them to do things and they'll do it. So, uh, anyway, let's pray. Father, we do thank you for our time together this morning and reminder of, uh, in Psalms about fearing you. And uh, thank you that we don't live in fear, but we can reverence you and uh, look, look to you for the things that you have done for us, the things that you will do for us, and that you are so worthy of, of our trust. And uh, we thank you for that. And Father, we, we ask this morning that as we look at uh, the book of John, that you would speak through George and uh, give him the words to say as we uh, move through the, the book of John and seeing things about our new life in you. And I pray that the things that we learn would encourage us, that it would help us to go through the week, um, to face the challenges that we, we face during the week. And we pray for um, uh, folks in our church, the Rollinses, thank you that, you're, that they're on the mend and that you'd continue to, to help them go through the COVID and uh, to deal with that uh, in a good way and just help them as they are in the same rooms together and just help, just help them get through that and recover from that and we pray the same thing for the Lotheries that you would do that for them also um, Father we pray for Jenna uh, Marshall as she is in training right now to do mission work God we pray that you would uh, give her strength and that you would give her wisdom and that you would give her patience and endurance to go through the training that they're giving her and that the training that she receives would really enhance the ministry that you have for her in the future. Um, Lord, we uh, ask that you be with the college students as they hit the midway point um, and the things that they have to do on campus and that you would cause them to to look at it from your perspective and to learn the things that you want them to learn and to see the places that they are on campus as their mission field and to put you first. And we pray that we would all do that, that we would put you first in all that we do. And we pray for our time this morning, pray that we would go away with uh, things that we could apply to our lives. Thank you that your word is true, that it never changes, and that we can trust uh, the things that we read and the things that we apply to our lives. And we pray these things in your son's name. Amen.